Hello everyone, this is Alberto Corona with RainNetworks.com and today we're going to be showing you how to set up software installation tasks. So first we're going to want to go over to our tasks. And then we're going to want to create, go down to where it says new. And we're going to create a client task. We're going to select a task category. We're going to go ahead and select a ESAT security product. We're going to go down to task and we're going to go to software install. We can change the name if we'd like, but for the purpose of this video, we're just going to name it new task one. We're going to go ahead and hit continue. We're going to make sure we select the right license. For this, we only have one license. So we're just going to go ahead and click on that one. If you want to set this up on different computers, you can click on them, but depending on the license. We're going to go ahead and hit OK. Next, we're going to go ahead and choose the package we wish to install. So we can go ahead and filter via operating system, or we can go ahead and filter by language. But we already have this right setup, Windows and English. And we're going to go ahead and click this one. This is the one we want to install, the ESA Endpoint Security. And it is the newest version, the 8.02. So we're going to go ahead and click that. We're going to go ahead and hit OK. We're going to accept to the terms of the application. And then we're going to go ahead and hit Finish. Next, it's going to want us to create a trigger. So we're going to go ahead and do that. We can change the name if we'd like, but we're just going to go ahead and leave it the same. We're going to go to Target. We're going to add a computer. For me, this computer is the one that I'm currently using. So we're going to go ahead and click that one. We're going to hit OK, click that, go ahead and hit continue, and then you can go ahead and set it up as soon as possible. You can schedule it for once a week, daily, monthly, yearly, or other options. But for this, we're just going to hit as soon as possible, and the expiration date, you can change it to whatever you'd like. Then we're going to go ahead and hit finish, and the task has been scheduled. Alright, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next time.